Yesterday we took a look at how it is that we view things and how it is that we view others and maybe even how it is that people view us. And if we were honest with ourselves, we'd find that we have areas, blind spots, that we have in our lives that we tend to not notice. It's not easy to see discrimination in the mirror. It's not easy to see judgment in the mirror. And yet we know that we all tend to do it. Our goal this week is to walk alongside James and as he says, hey, show me your faith, we're going to take a look at us showing others our faith. But we have to put away those areas that we struggle with. Racial biases, people because of the way that they act, maybe because of the way that they dress, maybe because they seem like they don't have as much as we have, to put all those things away. James says this, he says, what good is it, my brothers and sisters, if people claim to have faith but have no deeds? Can such faith save them? And the answer is no. It is so important that the actions that we have, the actions that we do, match the faith that we claim to have. But to have that kind of faith, we need to put every single issue, every single discriminatory thought, every single bias away so that we can reach and love others. Because we are reaching them and loving them where it is that they live, where it is that they struggle, where it is that they have issues and problems. And our faith, by the actions that we have, is seen when we go to meet them right where they are. It's just what Jesus did. Would you choose to do the same? You'll get a chance to ask yourself that question this week and maybe even answer it.